This is Elton Hobson with CanadianProfighter.com being joined by Mike 300 Hayes, victorious tonight in his uh, heavyweight contest. Mike, uh, give me your thoughts on how the fight went. Did uh, Before the fight you talked, you want to keep the fight standing. Uh, you mix it up a lot during the fight. How did you see it going and uh, how did it play out for you? Um, it didn't play out quite like I wanted it to. I really wanted a knockout and I think I was kind of head hunting, which hurt me a little bit in the fight. Um, Steve Banks is a big guy and he's super tough, so my, I felt like I was on the verge of knocking him out, knocking him down, doing something, just wouldn't happen. Um, and yeah, I wasn't planning on wrestling at all. Um, I'm not a wrestler by any means, but uh, it, the opportunities presented themselves and so I tried to take advantage of them. Well, it was certainly effective. Um, going into this fight, a lot of people were talking about the size difference between you. Over 30 pounds, uh, even at the weigh-in, so who knows how much it was coming into the cage. Do you feel like that was a factor in implementing your game plan, or do you feel like it helped you out because uh, you had a larger gas tank? No, I feel like, uh, I don't know, I guess I definitely should have had a better gas tank than I did for this fight. Uh, usually my cardio is a lot better than that, but the size difference did make a, a huge difference for me when, uh, when we were clinching which happened a lot during the fight, and that like 30, 40 pounds, that wears on you. Like no matter what you're trying to do, when you're trying to move that much extra weight, it, it's gonna wear on you, and I definitely felt it. There's a talk before this fight that uh, it was kind of a preview, I suppose, for season three and the, uh, the beginning of a heavyweight tournament. Do you feel like with a victory, you've kind of established yourself as an early favorite in that tournament? I don't know about an early favorite. Um, I feel like I definitely locked in my spot in the tournament, so I'm pretty happy to get that out of the way. Um, hopefully, uh, hopefully they'll announce that. Hopefully, it is locked in. Um, but I don't know about a favorite. I, I definitely didn't perform the way that maybe I I know I could have, and that other people shot thought that I uh, should have. Um, so I guess we'll we'll have to see. We'll, we'll see what happens. Okay. And uh, standing here victorious uh, with the camera and you know the internet watching, is there anyone you'd like to call out? Any fights uh, you'd like to take after this? Assuming you know after the eye heals, of course. Yeah, I'll take whoever that they throw at me. I've never backed down from a fight. I'm not one to shy away from anything. I, I love fighting. I love what I do. Um, so I'm just, I'll be honored to take on whoever they throw at me, whether it's Eddie Sanchez, Cole Conrad, uh, whoever else they throw into the tournament. I'm just, I'm excited for that tournament. Well, great performance tonight, and we look forward to seeing you again. Thanks, Mike. Thank you very much. This is Elton Hobson for CanadianProFighter.com, signing off.